and you are watching a glitch video about a hidden area in World of Warcraft. Today, we will be breaking out of bounds in the Black Moor Ass. Game Uncrafter is a channel dedicated to playing games incorrectly, and if you want to see more glitches, make sure to subscribe, and to show support, you can like this video or leave a comment below. All support is greatly appreciated. In this video, I will be showing and teaching you how to break out of bounds in the Black Morris. I will show you what's beyond the mountains, and I will have a short conclusion at the end of the video for future videos and maybe some other information. Well, now that we've pretty much drained Strathlum of its glitches, we are moving on to a different area, the Caverns of Time. There is so much to look for here, and many places to try and glitch out of. I've glitched out a few more areas here, but uh, those videos are for the future. The Black Morass is an interesting instance. In current day World of Warcraft, it is a, an area called the Blasted Lands. And if you know much about WoW's lore, you'll know that the Blasted Lands were formed out of the Black Morass because of, well, Medivh. He decided to open this thing called uh, the Dark Portal, you may have heard of it, and uh, he let the orcs pour into Azeroth. And then, and since you are trying to stop the Black Dragonflight from destroying the portal, the time has come to shatter this clockwork universe forever. If you think about it, it would be pretty darn awful for the World of Warcraft universe if the current horde was not able to help against, say, I don't know, the Legion. But anyway, Medivh was successful, and the lush Black Moor ass became a desolate, barren blastlands because of the portal. Now it's time to actually perform the glitch. After you walk into the Black Morris, you'll notice that the obvious. It is surrounded by mountains, and you're trapped in a swampy area. I tried to climb through many paths throughout the mountains to get on top of them, but scaling them is actually harder than it looks. You'll see here that I had trouble finding the right spot to climb up. Complete failures. I did find an area or two to glitch up, but in my second attempt to perform the glitch, I discovered a very quick and very easy way to the top of the mountains. I performed this glitch with a, well dang, come on guys, you know the drill, a freaking demon hunter. What other class would I use to break out of bounds? Anyway, you'll exit the little entrance uh, from the instance portal and you'll turn facing toward the rocks. When facing the rocks, move to the left side of them. They kind of look like a rock cliff. When you start jumping, make sure to use these rocks for every bit of leverage you can find. Then, when you cannot use the rocks anymore, make sure you to try and fly to the flatter sections of the mountains. With a tad bit of skill and a little bit of mountain scaling knowledge, you should be able to scale to the top of the mountains with very little issue. And voila, you just broke out of bounds in the mountains and found a hidden glitched area in World of Warcraft's Caverns of Time's Black Morass. There aren't even any invisible barriers, so you really don't need to have Metamorphosis or Door of Shadows. Just a bit of parkour and glide and, well, you know, double jumping. Now it's time to explore. But do be sure to look at the gorgeous scenery of the swamp. It uh, truly is quite beautiful. So definitely before you continue, make sure to at least check this out. The first thing I attempt to do in the top layer of the zone is travel north in order to see if there's more to the glitched area. Nothing immediately popped out. It's um, well it's flat. And there's definitely a lot of, I can't believe I'm gonna make this joke, but uh, there's more ass up here. Uh, oh man. Oh man, that, that was bad. But anyway, you'll see that under the flatness, you can see the swamp and all of its beauty. Still, nothing truly stuck out to me, and so I decided to head in the eastern direction. 
Sometimes glitches take a while to get through and there may not be much to really look at, but you never know what you might find. In the east corner of the map, I was able to see inside of the Caverns of Time's entrance, but nothing else of interest was noted and so I decided to turn south and um... Yeah, there's not much over there either. But don't give up hope yet, is what I told myself. So on to the west, I traveled to conduct more and more research. And yeah, there, there honestly wasn't a whole lot over there either. And uh, I finally then decided to run back towards the north where I originally glitched out of bounds. Some interesting scenery was viewable along the way, but sadly, once again, nothing. And after not having any luck in the open flatness of the Morris, I decided to just explore around the mountains. And to be honest, seeing the portal in the background is quite mesmerizing. It does bring me back to a time when all the crap Blizzard is currently doing just kind of disappears. Then a moment later I come back to reality and remember that Bobby Kotick has been uh, recently subpoenaed to, to the court for, you know, stuff. And, uh, well, I got off my mount for a bit more control so I didn't fall back into the swamp, and uh, I just kind of screwed around for a bit. After a while, I did find a weird textured area into the east, and so that's definitely a bit strange. Probably best not to fall in there. Uh, this mountain looks kind of a bit off as well, and otherwise, there, oh, there really wasn't that much. I knew I had one more task. I had to do it. And since I really couldn't find a whole lot of things that were of interest out in the glitched area of the map, um, I decided to make the final part of this glitch, well, you guessed it, jumping onto the dark portal. What else do you do whenever you have the ability to jump onto the dark portal in an area you cannot fly? You're going you're to jump onto it if you can. Um, it took me a bit to line up the correct area to make sure that the jump would work, but here is nothing. Duh, okay, for a second I just stood there in the air, but whatever. And there you have it, jumping onto the dark portal in the Black Moras. Sadly, that uh, pretty much sums up this glitch. There's really not too much going on, but uh, some great scenery and something that I've always wanted to do. Oh yeah, what happens if you... Well, never mind. Conclusion! That concludes today's video. Thank you all for sticking around and watching how to glitch out of bounds in the Black Morris, even though it was a bit uninteresting and quite easy to actually do. But uh, I hope, if anything, the video was informative, uh, if not a bit dry, unlike the Black Moor. Wow! To show support for the channel, you can like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. The next few videos will probably be about glitching out of the cameras of time, but, you know, we'll see how all of that ends up. Game Uncrafter out!